seventh year in a row that we received a tropical weather system before the official start to the Atlantic hurricane season, which is tomorrow. We'll talk a little bit about that in just a second. But first, enjoy this beautiful view right here. A little bit of uh, eye candy overlooking Railroad Park in downtown Birmingham. The temperatures are headed for the 60s here within the hour, likely going to see those 70s on the thermometer right now, and then about 80 degrees already by midday tomorrow. It's 74 in Birmingham, 72 in Alabaster, 60 degrees right now in Coleman, likely going to see 66 degrees in Anniston as well. So talking a little bit more more about that uh, hurricane season forecast because tomorrow is the start to the Atlantic hurricane season forecasting potentially three to five major hurricanes and that means a category three or greater could be catastrophic and even if these particular hurricanes don't make it inland the forecast could still hold up so we'll be watching of course our satellite always tracking the tropics into the mid-atlantic portions of uh, most of east alabama saw a lot of it but we saw these tropical features hit us from every single direction last year we ran out of names and then we got into the greek alphabet but that's not going to happen anymore we're just going to recycle more names and continue to add those to the list we've got anna it's, it was Anna. I think you guys said Anna earlier, but it, he, he don't think he watches Frozen as many times as I've watched it. <laughs> Just an FYI, and I respect that about Guy. 74 degrees is your current temperature and east breeze at about three miles per hour. So a little bit of an easterly wind, just barely that dry air holding on. So if the winds are coming out of the east, they're nudging in that stable air, a little bit of moisture is approaching and the forecast models are picking it up. It's a little bit overdone here on this forecast model, but it shows the general motion and the weakening trend as it heads into Mississippi in the next 36 hours. So notice we have more humidity into Tuesday as well as by Tuesday afternoon and Wednesday morning, a couple of spotty showers, but it's still very disorganized. And I think by Wednesday night and Thursday, that's when we see a more well-defined line of showers and thunderstorms approaching our western counties first. So 60s overnight, 80s by midday tomorrow. In your seven-day forecast, we are going to get pretty close to 90 degrees over the next several days.